Coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Well, what a pop from the crowd as this guy makes the walk. Such a well-rounded fighter, and you gotta think when the opponent breaks him down on film, not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video. This is a true mixed martial artist. May not stand out in any one area, but plus skills across the board, probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight. This guy is extremely well-rounded. His submissions are world-class. His striking is excellent. And he is extremely unpredictable in what attack he chooses to go with. Well, the crowd pops as this guy makes the walk to the octagon, and you can see why if you've watched film on him. This is a true mixed martial artist, plus skills in all areas, and figures to be a handful, really, for anybody in this division. Probably comfortable tonight anywhere the fight goes. Truly a well-rounded MMA fighter. You know, we, we, we trot that term out there a lot. This guy fits the bill. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. You never know what he's gonna do. His striking is world-class, his ground game is excellent, and he mixes them up very well. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. And once again, here is the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record on. Five wins, no losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, the three. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A mixed martial artist holding professional record on. Five wins, three losses. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada, the three. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Lavin. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? You ready? And we are underway. All right, ready to go for round one with the winning streak intact. Here he is. He won his last fight by decision. So the focus tonight, the finish. A finish would certainly be useful for him as he tries to take his career to the next level. We'll see if he can continue the momentum here tonight. And he connects there. Nice defense there, huge block. Hit him with the jab. He's doing a real good job of landing those punches. Oh, snaps off the jab effectively yet again. Oh, nice kick. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Blocks that kick to the body, Joe, well done. That one hurt. Oh, nice. Really missed with that right hand. Inside leg kick. Oh, there's a takedown attempt. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Oh, he is stumbling. Oh, straight right. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. And an inside leg kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. And the kick lands. Huge leg kick. Big straight punch. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Big punch from the bottom. He's stuck in half guard here, but he's landing some nasty combinations. Damaging strike there. 
Oh, nice elbow from the... That's it! It's oh, unbelievable! Wow. What a knockout. Ruthless ground and pound for the victory. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound, and it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight, and that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next, and ultimately the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. And let's see if we can get a better look at that from another angle. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 30 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the three. So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates, his coaches, and his friends after this monumental victory here under the bright lights tonight.